being born and raised in South Africa, I had a pretty clear understanding of what was considered taboo as far as subject matter to teenagers concerning sex and, and health care. And I think I always wanted to do something. And so in 2007, I decided to give birth to the Charlize Theron Africa Outreach Project. Really, at the core, what we wanted that project to be was something where we could encourage a safe environment for, for young people of Africa, where they could not only just discuss HIV and AIDS and the consequences and the prevention, but also talk about what's happening to them in their communities and socially with them, to get them comfortable to actually just have this conversation. And the longer we've been doing it, it really has just become meeting with young people of this country and really understanding the needs and really give them the environment where they felt safe to throw this big dark cloud of what HIV and AIDS was out the window and, and to maybe turn the light on the realities of, of living in this country. We're at a very, very crucial moment right now where one decision can decide their future f for the rest of their life. An entire generation was wiped out because of a disease that nobody wanted to talk about. But the truth of the matter is certain pockets of people are falling through the cracks and if we don't go all the way where there's zero infections and zero people dying from this, this is a disease that will it will come back roaring. When it comes to this work, I think my dream is that this generation can make that change. The reality of stopping AIDS is around the corner. That's the part that maybe drives me the most in wanting to really get that across, that we can stop AIDS.